Hello and welcome. I am here today with the incredible Tony Lindsay. Lisa as, darling. Oh, as well as Brett Ziegler. <laughs> and we are going to be looking at, well, Tony's expertise, which is singing with soul. But we're also going to be diving into how to duet. Expertise, you said? Expertise. Oh my God. When you sing. That's a lot of pressure. When you sing, everybody just has to pay attention. I hope so. And that's what you've taught us is singing with soul. That's true. That is true. So, singing from your heart. I want to learn with how. With soul. I want you to teach me how to sing with soul. I think you already know how to do it, but we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna check you out right now. Okay, okay, okay. So, right, are we ready? Mm. We're gonna we're gonna be singing "Endless Love," which is normally a duet by Lionel Richie, I believe, and Diana Ross. I think oh, it was stunning. Okay, let's try it out, and then I'll, I'll take some tips from Tony. All right, friends, when you're duetting, you're often in a position where you have to sing a harmony. So if harmony is something you're brand new to, do not worry. We've got an entire level on how to sing harmonies and train your ears inside the Sing You method. So all you have to do to access those lessons is take advantage of our free seven-day trial. All right, back to your lesson. Oh, I like that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. My love. There's only you in my life The only thing that's right My first love Oh yeah Your every breath that I take Your every step I make That's sweet And I to share all my love with you no one else will do in your eyes your eyes, your eyes they tell me how much you Yeah. Okay. Now you see there? Yeah. We get into each other mm. when it comes in. So what happens when when uh, uh, duets, they're, they're feeding off each other. Yes, very much so. So if you see me singing and me getting into it, it is going to make you do the same thing and vice versa. Oh, so it kind of helps the process. That's it. I also found that I was really watching... I was watching your mouth to see when and how you were going to be like moving in and out of some of those notes so I could try to time with you a bit. And, and see, and we've never done this before. This is great because it's it's all about listening to each other. And, and we've never done this song before. No, this is a very yeah. spur of the moment decision. And you, were, you, you got a really good voice. Yeah. You. Now, see, if you were singing with somebody that they were doing a rock song or whatever, it would be a, a whole, a totally different approach. A very different approach. You know, we feed off each other, and of course, of course, brother Brett over there, you know, it, the way he plays the song too. Oh, that makes all the difference. It dictates the way that we sing it. <sighs> so, is there anything when approaching something like this, like just to sort of? help our, you know, audience and others out there who are wanting to kind of get into that soulful feeling in the duets. What are like the top pieces of advice you'd have for me going into this um, to really allow myself to connect to what's happening? Well, you know, one, one of the biggest things is just listening. Mm. The listening is, is the big part. You know, he, he set the tone for us when he started playing the yep. piano. Now, if he was playing... <laughs> giving a whole different vibe. Oh, actually. It brings a different energy. Brett, how would you feel about changing up the vibe on that a little bit? And we'll see what happens. And give us like a slightly sure. different energy on the song? Totally different sound or just the same? Like. Go for a different sound too. Different okay. sound. Diff just change it up. And we'll see yeah. what happens. You see what I'm saying? Uh, uh. My love, 
there's only you in my life the only thing that's right That's, he set the tone for us. My goodness. And some people listen to that. And you just feel it. Yeah. And you just go with it. And you know what was weird? What was weird? Because the first thing that came to my mind when we were doing it this this way was me to sing it up even the, uh, an octave. Yeah. My love, there's only you in my life. But then I don't know when I had to go up to the other <laughs> But how it was going to end. That, that makes sense, right? That's more energetic. It's more energetic. So you change your approach. And that was that thing that, um, with the Santana song, Smooth. Mm. Rob Thomas did it, and he was that, oh, it's a hot one. But when I sang it, it's, man, it's a hot one. Like seven inches from the midday sun. I hear you whisper in the words about everyone. But you stay so cool. You see what I'm saying? And that was my <laughs> approach. Because wow. it gave it that rock feel, it the rock punchier. energy. Exactly. <laughs> so circling back, it's about listening. Yeah, and you know, it's, and especially picking up on the, the people that are setting up everything for you, because mm. they're setting it up that way for you know for a reason. Right. And now, if we had, if we were doing endless love, yep. and we had a guitar player in here, yep. that had that like heavy metal rock sound on his guitar, it would be different. Oh, totally different. <laughs> and then you want to sing in more more rock vibe. More aggressive. Or you want to ballet? My love, there's only you in my life. You know what I mean? <laughs> oh, man. Okay, so earlier you were saying something about not thinking. Yep. And I really loved that. Because I know for me... Probably my biggest downfall is I like get in my head before I'm about to sing. And I'm yes. Like, and you know when most people do most of the thinking, if if you have to make a transition going into something that's going to take you higher, you have a tendency to go, oh, my God, oh, no, oh, no, it's coming to that note. Oh, my God, am I going to? And that would screw you up if, if you just go ahead and let it float let it right go. into it. You know, if you hit it, you hit it. If you don't, you don't. <laughs> that's why we practice. But thinking... When you're singing, you know, that's why the other thing that is really cool is um, when you know a lyric for a song mm. and you don't have to, we don't have to read it or, or think about what we're doing. That helps you, it helps you to be able to get into it a lot more. There's all, all those little things, mm. but they all help to make that thing real sweet. You got to hit that sweet spot. <laughs> we hit the sweet spot on that one, though. That was super fun. The sort of final thing I, I would love to look at, because I think this often gets overlooked, especially in a duet setting, is mm -hmm. is like vocal texture almost. So like that that matching. So I wonder if almost we sang just that end, like, Mah. Well, see, that was the other thing, too. Both of us were, were looking at each uh -huh. other, and we knew. Yeah. When it's time for the dynamics to, the, to happen on those, uh, yeah. It's 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 um, like visual cues, yeah. but then it's also listening for. I'm paying attention to. Okay, is Tony starting to to back off? Where would it be ideal for me to use the sweeter parts of my voice, and where would it be ideal to just like open up and kind of let it go? Well, that depends on the song too. Yes. You know, because when we get to that, that that my love, all that's got to be. You know, and then you're my first love. Da, da, da. That's all soft. It's so sweet. My first but when the voice, when both of the voices kick in, 
and I, I want to cheer my love. And we get to that, oh, yes, you will always be my endless. All that stuff got to be. It's also the part of the story the that we're telling. I'm telling you. I think we should end this lesson with one final pass. Notice how the story, the words are dictating the emotion behind the voice. That's it. Okay. That's what it is. <clears throat> Here we go. Oh, that's so sweet. So sweet. <laughs> My love, there's only you in my life the only thing that's right my first love your every breath that i take your every step i make and i I want to share all my love with you. No one else will do. Ooh. In your eyes, your eyes, your eyes, they tell me how much you care. But that's the idea. That's the idea. Ah! Yeah. Thank you. There are many ways of approaching it, but... That was fun. Make your way the right way. <laughs> Record it. Share it with us. We would love to hear. And happy singing. Boom! Boom! <laughs>